oh my gosh, it's, it, it's imperative to take a step back. I'm going to say that first and foremost, because when we look at what everybody else is doing and we put ourselves on that, the hamster wheel of trying to do what everybody else is doing, we're going to do nothing but sabotage ourselves. First and foremost, we have to recognize that we are on our own journey. Our journey is unique and it has been designed by God for us. And everything that has led us to this point in time has been designed, created for us. So for us to look outside of of the journey that we are on at this moment in time is going to do nothing but hold us back and increase our anxiety because we aren't meant to be and we're not meant to do what other people are and are doing. And so if, if you can just stop and focus on you and the key to that is to align your values in every single thing you do, whether it's personal, whether it's business, if you are aligning yourself to your values, you're going to be able to take intentional action. That's going to move you forward without having to look at what everybody else is doing. And I think that's where anxiety can be so triggered is when you are trying to do it all because other people are doing what they're doing and you're trying to do what they're doing, but it's not aligned with you. And so we get derailed. And when we get derailed, it's sometimes very, very hard to get back on the car and, you know, get on track again. So I think it's really important to take that step back when you're starting to feel that way and yeah. recognize that, you know, like if I were trying to follow you, I think our values are very similar, but our personalities are totally different. You're very yeah. high energy. You're, you know, you're prop. Are you an extrovert? Uh, yeah, I am. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you know, like to totally different personalities yeah. where, so I can't do what you're doing. Yeah. And if I try to do what you're doing, it's going to increase my anxiety because I'm going to feel like I'm failing. I'm going to feel like an imposter and it's going to drag me down. Yeah. Whereas if I stay doing me, being the introvert that I am, you know, I can, I can provide value. I can, I can cheerlead for other people. I can tell them all of these nitty gritty, you know, tools and tips and systems and processes for growing a business. But if I try to do it your way, I'm going to exhaust myself and my anxiety level is going to be super high. So it's really important that if you start to feel that way. Take a step back. This hustle culture is not God led. First yeah. of all, for I mean, sure. for you know, sure. like, and sometimes you just have to take a step back and yeah. say, okay, Holy Spirit, activate and bring me back to reality because yeah. we all get caught up in this. We yeah. see that, you know, so-and-so is achieving success because they're doing X, Y, Z, but that doesn't mean we have to do X, Y, Z in order for us to have success. 